According to the manual, the command mark time march can only be given while marching, which makes sense. If you want them to mark where they're marching, they have to have already been marching. But you'll find that it's a very easy and useful command to give early on in your training process when your unit is just beginning to learn to march. It allows them to establish their beat, to all get into the rhythm, and to make sure their feet are going the right one at the right time. But remember, they always start off with that left foot, and some of them may not have. So giving mark time march at the beginning allows them to do that. Technically, it's not correct, but you'll find a lot of drill instructors use it because it really answers a lot of the problems that they have. Forward at half step, march. Your left, your left, your left, right, left. Mark time, march. Oh, ouch! Has this ever happened to you? Trees popping up out of nowhere? An important issue that drill instructors tend to forget is distance. Every now and then, you'll be marching, and a tree, a wall, maybe anything, will pop up, and you can't run into it. So, the best thing to do is call a mark time march. Within, before you hit the tree, you want to keep three paces in between, and that prevents the group from running into that.